Hello, my babies. Hello, my babies. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. So, this morning, I am going to give you guys some advice for the day. So, I have two piles here. So, I'm going to give you a second to choose from those. I'm going to get myself together. And I'm just going to offer you guys a quick little morning message to get you guys going. I decided it would be fun to do this sometimes, so I'm doing it. <laughs> so, go ahead and choose from it, and I will be back in one moment. we have today for my pile number ones like my little candle can I get the advice cards for pile number one can I get the advice cards for pile number one yeah, everyone's a teacher we have abundance Worthiness. So you have everyone's a teacher, you have abundance, and you have worthiness. So what I'm seeing here for you guys, pile number one this morning, is to remember that you can learn from anyone around you. Anyone around you can teach you something, even if it's something like small, like to appreciate the things you have, even if it's something like, oh, maybe to watch what you eat more. Why why maybe okay, so this could be the thing. Like some of you guys can it could be something like maybe you see someone that's really overweight and you used to be overweight and they remind you like to make sure you're watching your eating habits. Maybe you see someone like cussing out their girlfriend or boyfriend and you're and, and reminds you to have effective communication and not to be in toxic relationships just understand that you can learn from anyone around you okay there um and that's card out is abundance i don't know i'm hearing abundance of lessons of abundance of things to learn is abundance of something abundance of information or something so if you if you seek the information you will find it if you seek information you will find it okay there's all because like i feel like sometimes we feel like we ask for help and we feel like maybe our angels forgot about us maybe god forgot about us because nobody is saying anything to us you get what i'm saying so we feel like maybe at, they don't have time to help us right at the moment and I don't know how to explain. Like, you get what I'm saying? Like, I feel like sometimes we might feel like it's, we might feel like pile number one, like there's not, like their angels don't have time for us. So we might ask for something or ask for help and we feel like they're like ignoring us or whatever sign that we ask for is taking long. And they don't, they don't, they want you to know, like, pay attention. So today your goal is to pay attention because there's always signs around you. There's all, if the universe is always guiding you, but you have to keep your head up and you have to pay attention, right? The last card out is worthiness. So what I'm saying with this card is just know that you are very much worthy. But I mean, this is more so about what he's doing with the um with the ice cream and he's like eating it and it tastes good. It's like you you can get advice, you can ask for advice, you can ask for signs, you can ask for guidance and stuff, but if you're not um if you're not willing to take that advice, if you're not willing to pay attention to those signs, it's not going to help you, right? So you have to not only ask for it, not only um, pay attention to it, but actually use it, okay? So actually use it. So basically what I'm saying overall your advice for today is to pay attention to the signs and synchronicities and people around you. People, it's, you can learn a lesson at any time. You can learn some of the importance at any time. You can get answers to whatever your questions are at any time. Your angels have never left you, but you need to pay attention. And then when you get the signs, you need to apply it, okay? So that is your advice for today, pile number one. I hope it resonates. If it does, please let me know. Make sure you like this video. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. We'll hit the post notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a video. If you're interested in a personal being that information in the description box below. If you're interested in some actual video giveaway, all you have to do is leave a red heart in the comment section below. Okay, power number two. Let's see what we got going on. So we have harmony, loyalty, and let's get one more card. Okay. 
I already know this is going to be about your relationships, friendships, and romantic today. And then you have rest. So, what I'm seeing here, pile number one, is the first card out is harmony. So, today your advice is to connect, to, uh, connect more with your friends and family. Connect more with the love around you. Because, yes, we want to get money. Yes, we want to get our manifestations. Yes, we want to get that bag. Yes, we want to work on ourselves. But our relationships are also very much important. The relationships we have with ourselves and the relationships that we have for others. Because what is life without what is life without without people without family you get what i'm saying so we want to have you want you want to get most of us want to get money so we can be able to do things more socially and and be able to provide for ourselves and provide for our family but if you're so busy providing not making a connection it's 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 like it's kind of pointless okay so i'm trying to figure out the best way to explain is to explain this is like okay you ever seen like uh kids who had really much pretty much everything growing up like their parents are really rich and everything but yet they they still have like an estranged um, they have a, a strange, like a, a strange and strange uh, relationship with their parents. Their parents were maybe always working or something like that. Some of you guys have parents like that. Understand that money is fine, finance is okay, everything which that you're working on is important. But making connections with your friends and family is also important because you can really hustle your way to the top and get up there, and no one's there because you were ignoring everybody. You were like, you know, fuck everybody. I'm on my grind. So pay more attention to your friends and your family. Just know, like, get no matter what, even as you grow, even as you grow, um, the people around you grow. Okay, you don't need to grow by yourself. You don't need to just work on yourself and, and just be like oh well once i make it then i guess i'll come hang out with y'all why not try to include the people around you and the things that you're doing to try to, so that way you're not only spending time with them but you're also um you're all there you're also a point into somebody else's life which is make, helping them grow with you i'm not saying i'm not saying that you need to change people i'm not saying you can change people but i'm saying like if you know something and maybe your friend is interested too it's nothing wrong with asking them hey do you want to tag along like i'm doing this today for my business maybe you can come with me like you get what i'm saying it's nothing wrong with that you know or even with your children because i remember to give you an example because i tell you but i'm like to help you out with charles i have i have met this lady at this like entrepreneur workshop but she does real estate right and she I, I, a couple weeks ago i seen her at the bank with her daughter her daughter actually had a bank account at the at the business uh bank that i was at right and it was crazy and i was like how does she have a bank account here she's like seven right but and then she's always posting reels business reels with her daughter's business and all that stuff right so her to spend also so not only she's spending time with her daughter she's helping her daughter build her own generation of wealth at a young age because that's something that she likes to do right so she kind of made it fun for her daughter because like her 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 daughter reels are like really fun like i don't know how to explain it but it's like catered to the child right so it's like she's also running her business also like you know doing her thing but she included her child so that way they have something to bond over and you know it's something that they both have interest in so don't don't feel like you need to change people because like i feel like a lot of times your friends when you when you make friends a lot of them, you guys have the same interest so include your friends in what you're doing i think they would really appreciate it okay pile number two then even if it's I, even if it's just like spirituality or i'm hearing a yoga or exercise or something like that ask people if they want to come not you don't have to ask people all the time it's okay to be alone but i'm just saying like i can see there's a strain on your relationships in your life right your last card is rest so with the rest card i feel like you guys work really really hard you guys work on your your fitness you guys might work on your your business you guys might work on your career you guys might work on your spirituality you guys are always working and studying on something and that's great and that's cool and like you know we appreciate that but at the same time spirit is saying to get rest so rest time can mean staying in the house sometimes yes watch your tv chilling whatever you like to do we rest but it also means going out to eat with your friends going to the gym with your friends hanging out with your friends just doing shit that's not gonna not gonna actually propel you in life but shit that's gonna make you happy it is okay to take rest from the grind to take rest from who you want to be and actually chill and make yourself happy and make yourself uh, make yourself happy and make yourself um yeah make yourself happy and chill like it's okay to chill sometimes okay but 
yeah so with, overall what your advice is to work on your relationships because there's obviously a straining relationships try to grow with people um uh, try to share your knowledge i feel like there's the people around you that want to do what you're doing but they feel like they're too busy to insert themselves so start inviting them and then you have and then with rest again make sure you're getting your rest and also make sure you're doing things that you actually enjoy in life and that's not all about grinding and what you're trying to do with your future you have to have a balance a happy work-life balance but with that being said that is your reading pile number two i hope it resonates if it does please let me know know make sure you like this video make sure you subscribe to my channel hit the post notification bell so you can be notified every time i post a video if you're interested in a personal reading that information in the description box below if you're interested in my free reading giveaway all you have to do is leave a red heart in the comment section below with that being said i'll see you guys in the next reading bye